Last week, an ongoing issue here in downtown Richmond came to a head when the city's only ladder truck from the fire department was used to water the hanging baskets that you see along downtown in Main Street. When you donate to the Habitat Restore, you do more than just clear out stuff from your home or office. By donating it to the Restore, you can help build a new home for someone in need. The donation is tax deductible and they will even come pick it up from you. Check out the Restore for yourself, located behind the Richmond Mall or on Facebook. We spoke to firefighter and union member Corey Lewis who told us this isn't just an issue with the truck being out of commission, but a personnel issue as well. So the Richmond Fire Department has been doing a lot with very little. Um, we perform significant rescue tasks for the city of Richmond. We provide a variety of fire suppression, motor vehicle collision, extrication, basic life support, emergency medical services for the citizens of Richmond. Um, and we do that, I think, in a very efficient and effective manner. Um, and the motto of doing more with less has just continued to plague our department and plague our agency. And so the issue at hand is the misuse of firefighters to water flowers up and down Main Street in front of City Hall and various locations throughout the city of Richmond. And the NFPA says that we need to be ready to respond once the call is notified at our fire station in 80 seconds. So firefighters have 80 seconds from the time the call comes out to their station to run to the bay to the nearest fire truck that they're, sta they're tasked with being on, put on their bunker pants, their firefighting ensemble, all of their personal protective equipment, get on that truck and then the NFPA recommends that we have a response time to get that first fire truck onto that emergency scene in four minutes or less. And that is absolutely hampered by our firefighters not being on a fire truck, being in a pickup truck, blocks if not farther away from their fire station watering flowers. We've certainly been working with department leadership who I believe don't agree as well with the taking trucks out of service and placing firefighters at risk, you know, away from the fire truck and placing the community at risk uh, in watering the flowers. I think the big, that is the major issue. It's that having those firefighters not ready to respond at the station that is our issue. I have been made aware that in the 2017-2018 City of Richmond budget under Parks, Buildings and Grounds Division, there was a budgeted line item for a horticulturalist. And I was also made aware that the fire department even did not surplus a truck that we had, a pickup truck, so that we could give that to Parks, Buildings and Grounds for that horticulturalist to provide this service, the watering of the flowers, the maintaining of, of Main Street and the beautification projects that happen up and down Main Street. I think we all agree that Richmond's Main Street look really nice and inviting for everyone and I don't disagree with that. The professional firefighters at Richmond I think all would agree that they want Richmond to be a place they can be proud of. They want Richmond to be a place that people come to and it looks inviting and certainly aesthetically flowers up and down Main Street and pots and beautification projects like that are vitally important. We just don't believe fire departments, fire, the citizens should be at risk and taking firefighters out of and off of the fire trucks, putting them on a pickup truck, blocks away from the station, delaying that response to a real emergency is the right way to do that. It shall be seen in the coming weeks and the city commission meetings how adjustments will be made to change this. For WBON-TV, I'm Marissa Hempel.